Okay, thank you again for joining us in our weekly devotion out of the Upper Room. Our topic this week is God's Presence, and it comes to us from July the 18th, which was this Tuesday. Uh, the Bible verse is, God did not give us a spirit of cowardice, but rather a spirit of power and love and self-discipline. The devotion is fantastic because it talks about getting a new job, feeling anxious, and not qualified enough, and then reading the scriptures where so many of the biblical stories are people that really were not qualified, but God took care of them with his presence. You know, God is with us wherever we go, uh, no matter what we do, he's with us. I mean, you can't leave him. For instance, let me give you an example like this. You see, God is always with you. Well, I mean, I was thinking the camera is it's following me. God is always with you. Well, maybe the camera, sorry about that. <laughs> maybe the camera won't follow you, but God always follows you. He always takes care of you. If you've asked him to forgive you of your sins and come into your life, his presence is always there. And it is, it is stable. It is something that stays with us and, and loves us and guides us and directs us in so many different ways. Probably you have a story uh, in your own life where something supernatural happened and you thought that must have been God or maybe an angel like a near accident or an answer to prayer or whatever it may be. But I can guarantee you that God's presence, whether you feel it or not, is with you and will always take care of you.